I've always had a fascination for computers and technology. A lot of kids these days like to play games, but now they want to make them. And it's difficult because not many kids know where to go to find out how to make a program. I mean, for soccer, you could go to a soccer team. For violin, you could get lessons for a violin. But what if you want to make an app? And their par the kids' parents might have done some of these things when they were young, but not many parents have written apps. <laughs> Where do you go to find out how to make an app? Well, this is how I approached it. This is what I did. Uh, first of all, I've been programming in multiple uh, other programming languages to get the basics down, uh, such as Python, C, Java, etc. And then Apple released the iPhone, and with it, the iPhone software development kit. And the software development kit is a suite of tools for creating and programming an iPhone app. I've gotten a lot of interest and encouragement from my family, friends, teachers, and even people at the Apple Store, and that's been a huge help to me. I've got a lot of inspiration from Steve Jobs. And I started an app club at school, and a, a, a teacher at my school is kindly sponsoring my app club. Any student at my school can come and design, learn how to design an app. This is so I can share my experiences with others. These days, students know, usually know a little bit more than teachers <laughs> with the technology. <laughs> so... <laughs> sorry. <laughs> so this is a resource to teachers, and educators should recognize this resource and make good use of it. I'd like to continue my app club and find other ways for students to share knowledge with others. Thank you.